this time to get myself in shape. I really fell out of line this time. I really miss the game, and it's gone. I'm already so freaking tired of this intro. So, hello friends! I'm so tired. I'm sorry for not making a video on Friday. Um, because I'm so over it and I'm just so frantic and lost and can't even deal with... What is this? Is this... What is this? What does this mean? What is... What am I doing with my hands right now? I can't deal right now. So, I am not. I'm not dealing right now. So, there you have it. Um, goals. There you go. That's how I feel right now. <laughs> Uh, but I'm making a quick video to, to say that I have to go home to uh, Arkansas for a few days for an unexpected funeral. I had a family member pass away, so I'm going to the... What the hell is that? Is that granola or something? Anyway, um, an unexpected funeral. So now I have to actually go home to my small, small hometown and deal with all those things. So, I'm nowhere near healthy right now. In fact, I'm, I'm, I'm in self-destruct land. That's where my zip code is right now. So, um, I'm just letting you guys know that because I've met a lot of really cool, healthy, trying to be healthy people out there sharing their lives on, on the internet. And uh, you're trying to support me. I can feel you. You're trying to support me. I know you are. And I'm just not taking your support right now because I'm so lost in this effort. But I made a promise to myself to <laughs> go to Arkansas, deal with this family death, and then come back stronger than ever. I do want to give a good shout out. Do we do shout outs anymore? I don't know, I feel so old. I mean, I'm trying to be young, people. I'm on the MySpace and the Facebook and the Twitter, And I, I'm trying to be young. So just let me know if people don't say shout-out anymore. Um, so I'm trying to give a shout-out to my friend Tina, who basically kidnapped me into walking after work the past week. We went for three days in a row, increasing our walk each time. I think we walked at least a mile the last time, which for me was a, is a lot to walk in the Houston, Texas heat. Oh, it's been so hot. It's been so hot. Okay, I need to put like a little piece of, a piece of paper, maybe put a piece of paper over my face because I don't want to look at the monitor and see my ham hock face. As you can see, I have, when I get frustrated, there's a little secret about Kyle. When I get frustrated and life is out of control for me, I usually fuck up my hair in some way. I think it's because I have control over my hair. Well, not really. I mean, if I had control over my hair, I would have hair. But, so when I feel a little out of control, I guess sometimes I shave my hair... Sometimes I shave my face, which I obviously have not felt like doing in a couple of days. Um, I've also made some very big purchases over the past week, which is fine. I can afford them, but it's just, it's just uh, I think it's also an example of my manic behavior lately. Um... So the point being, I'm going to go to Arkansas, I'm going to take care of this business, and I'm going to come back and refocus. I need to refocus. I need to refocus. And I need my friend to go away. That's always nice. Hello. We'll just call him Larry. 
Hey, I'm Larry. <laughs> so, Larry, that's nice. Um, what else is going on in my life? I went and saw Star Trek. Playing with the ticket stuff. It was pretty good. I liked it a lot. Um, can you hear that buzzing? I um, have I decided if I'm going to take my camera to Arkansas because it's, you know, it's not really the happiest of occasions. Happy funeral, talk to my blog. You know, that kind of thing. Oh, I got my first jury summons ever. It was supposed to be tomorrow. Not tomorrow, Wednesday, but I had it rescheduled so I could go home to Arkansas. What else? You want to play what's in Kyle's purse? What's in my purse? Here's my journal, my food diary. April 20th. And then it stops. The weigh-ins, I have been keeping up with. You can tell that because the number keeps getting larger. Oh, here's some chapstick. That's good. My new cell phone. The LG View. A comb. I guess that's it. That's it for right now. Bicycle key. <laughs> yeah. Bicycle key. Woo! Who am I kidding? Uh, my nose spray that I never used. Anyway, oh, well, that was fun. What's in Kyle's purse? Oh, we gotta do. We gotta do. Uh, Starlet of the day, right? Where were we? Okay, here we go. Oh, I'm just tearing shit up left and right. Okay, leading ladies, the top 50 ladies of the studio era, as you may recall, when last we did, the, doing A through Z, we did, who did we do, Jean Arthur, Lauren Bacall, Ingrid Bergman, Clara Bow, Clara Bow, did we do Clara Bow? I don't remember if we did Clara Bow. Silent film star, died in 1965. She's only 60 years old. Okay, let's do this one. Louise Brooks, ladies and gentlemen. Louise Brooks. Fierce mama, born 1906, died 1985. I have no idea who she is. 1920s movies. Good look at this bitch. Look at her. That's pretty fierce. She's got some short hair there. I love it. Louise Brooks. A well-dressed woman, even though her purse is painfully empty, can conquer the world. Well, okay. All right, well, there you go. There you have it. I am done. I'm out of here. I'm going to Arkansas. I'll see you when I get back. Thank you for your support. I do accept it. And please make a comment. I need them. I need, a, I need to hear from you, so. All right, peace out. Bye.